So your database is slow, and you want to find out which queries are causing it. You're running SQL Server, Azure SQL DB, or Amazon RDS. The answer is to run SP Blitz Cache. This is a free stored procedure that's part of our open source first responder kit. And when you run it, it tells you the top 10 queries that have been using the most resources lately. It shows you the contents of the query, shows you the name of the query if you're using things like stored procedures or triggers or functions. And then if you scroll across, you can get the query plan so that you can go review that graphically. And we also give you tips on, hey, here are things that you should look at when you open the query plan. For example, does it perhaps have problems with parallelism? Does it have problems with table variables, uh, parameter sniffing, all kinds of things. Now, some of these you may not recognize, like, for example, long compile time, and you might wonder what that means. To find out, go down to the second result set down here. And this is kind of a glossary that explains what each of those warnings means. Plus, it gives you additional warnings, like up at the top there, it says plan cache information. This particular server is having a plan cache amnesia problem where it can't remember queries for very long. For every warning that we give you, we always give you a URL so that you can go learn more details about that particular problem. In case the query, the text of the warning over here isn't enough, we've got whole blog posts, resources, training videos, teaching you how to use execution plans, and much more. So a little bit more about that top result set. We're looking at the list of queries and their names. If you continue to scroll across, you also get all kinds of uh, metrics, like how much CPU the query has been using, total overall, as well as every time on average that it runs. We give you those same metrics for CPU, for reads, for memory grants, writes, and much more. Now, by default, when I say the most resource intensive queries, we're actually sorting that data by CPU, which queries are burning the most CPU. But if you're facing different kinds of problems on your SQL Server, for example, if you're facing problems with memory grants or queries that run a really long time, there are all kinds of other sort orders that you can use as well. To learn more about SP Blitz Cache, check out my training videos like how I use the first responder kit. Uh, and for information about how to parse some of these complex execution plans, what it is that SQL Server is doing inside here, which resources or which uh, uh, items on the execution plan you need to look at, check out my query tuning uh, classes like Fundamentals of Query Tuning and Mastering Query Tuning. Ideally, Everything that I give you for free, things like SP Blitz Cash and my YouTube videos, helps you get across the finish line. But if you can't get there, don't hesitate to click Consulting up at the top of the screen, and I can walk you through what's exactly causing problems on your SQL Server as well. Hope that helps.